<laughs> they wanted me to spit me out of the ground. What the problem is? <laughs> what the problem is? Whatever that fucking mean. <laughs> yeah. Ah, let's go. Fuck, fuck you niggas and I mean that. Yo. You want more, bitch, I bring that. Bring Real niggas dressing all black. I'll put your life in the past. Yeah. All you lames ain't gon' last. Yeah. Put that dumb shit in the trash. What else? Channel 45 asking what happened nigga. Big, big nigga and I'm husky yes, sir. I dare you niggas try to touch me try it. So official like the ref I got some real niggas that'll leave you dusty yeah. I, I ain't never had nothing no. Making something out of nothing nigga. Out here grinding real hard Trying, trying to, to turn, turn the debit into an English muffin yes, sir. I whip the work like a slave nigga Women. Streets know I'm a go-getter Get I can never be a whole nigga no. Real facts use a whole nigga yes, sir. Catch the boy in the cup, in the cup. Watch the pot bubble up Profit going double up double. Really never gave a fuck oh. My whole hood really bout that about Cross the line then we off black Kill a nigga when it's off black uh -huh. Smoke you chumps like some gas yeah. My father never really fuck with me Coward. None of you niggas can't fuck with me nope. Say it twice and you remember me None of y'all can't, can't fuck with me uh. So high, so high of life like I just fucked the molly Wait for a young dumb ass nigga to try me Giving them shots to the face of the body Guns like a boxer man shots to the body yeah. For Let's get it. I'm getting money, nigga. What? Uh -huh. I'm getting money, nigga. What? Nobody couldn't tell me nothing because a real nigga never gave a fuck. Never. Homie told me that was fucked up. Bad. Real talk, that was fucked up. Bad. When I see you, low nigga, hit you with that 40, let you know your time's up. Nigga. Greedy nigga still hungry. Yep. Yes, yes, the boy still hungry. Yep. I, I be in my own lane, fighting like a champ, getting to the money. Get all that stupid shit. I'm gonna get me some money and ball out. I'm gonna stack it so high to the ceiling that when it come to my house, you gon' fall out. Only real niggas know what I'm talking about. Shoot a fuck nigga like him in a movie. Speed up for reals like me shooting a Uzi. Crossing the beach, you be out of here. Homie, you know I don't show no fear. Treat you like magic, you disappear. Make sure you hate this, it's crystal clear. Get him away from here. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. There go, Dress it up to make it real for me. <laughs> Whatever that fuck to me. <laughs> what you bitch ass niggas, nigga?
calling all cars. Be on the lookout for a brown skin guy, dog tags, cornrows, and Oreos fitted. Last known whereabouts is in Baltimore. Last seen with this guy named Duke. They're bad. You know, I'm one of the best in the business. With a slick hand and holds up metal like kickstands I am hip-hop designing the form of this man Cause y'all was searching for a star Well, I'm Ed McMahon One of the sharpest MCs out of Maryland Only takes a couple blocks to build a Lego land Only takes one shot for me to bury a man Hey, your girl so in love, she wanna marry a man I'm back, I'm back on it, yes sir, I'm back on it So international, they should call me foreign So B.I.G., man, I should be enormous So damn fly, I should be enormous This is lyrical poise, tell MCs to join in I'm so Baltimore, these other rappers are so I'm the original scar. I teach you how to go hard and rip the skin from a snake and split a pee from a pod. I'm bad, 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 bad. And no rap can rap quite like I can. She's never been a rapper that's good for this long, this long, and this long. And, 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 and no rap can rap quite like I can. can, can, can. Suckers and jumps was hard till you heard me, then your ego strong. Don't make this ego dump up and reload back up and leave your ego for Nito. What's up? I'm called Leo, mix with Nino, better call your people. I give your girl dope, she call me Cock Jesus. I will not lose ever. I'm bad, so make the bad is destined to be the challenge. Conquer any that manages, this in the butter canvas. Yes, I'm such a savage. Yes, I'm so the baddest rapper that spit with carrots. Yes, I got an advantage. Ain't no rapper can rap quite like I can. Guess I'm the baddest of the baddest, plus I'm bad with a pen. Hey, yo, Dukey, take a look at what I done. Used to rock in the basement, now I'm number one, and I'm bad, 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 bad. And no rapper can rap quite like I can. Never been a rapper that's good for this long, this long, this long, this long. And, 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 and no rapper can rap quite like I can. can. In the bush, so tell mommy bye bye. For the competition, I'm as real as can be. So you can bet your favorite rapper ain't realer than me. I bar, I'm bad. All the rappers know it. when I enter the place, they say, Yo, yo, there he go. And I'm the pinnacle, that means I reign supreme. And I'm the toys, not from Brooklyn, but I'm PIG. And I ain't from West Coast, but I'm PAC. And I ain't LL, I'm just a GOAT. And a dope MC, in the place to be. So by now, you already know that I'm BAD. I bars the ride, so you better make way. It's anybody in the crowd they say the kid don't play and i will not lose ever i'm bad bad bad, bad. and no rap can rap quite like i can she never been a rapper that's good for this long and this long and this long and, this long, and, this long, and no rap can rap quite like i can 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 Good evening, coming live from Huntsville, Alabama. A up and coming rapper from Memphis, Tennessee, goes by the name of CT, has a new song out right now called Bills, and it has already caused a lot of controversy. People like Thoughts and Female Scammers will definitely not appreciate the message in this song. I've listened to it, and personally, I feel like a lazy person will hate it. I've also interviewed people on the street. And they feel like it's a player's anthem. One man says, and I quote, it's about time someone brought their real shit back. The music nowadays is the same old shit, just from a different artist. And I appreciate whenever CT drop, because I know it's always going to be hot. Nothing like that Bowling Brook stalker that's a vice lord at night and hiding under the bed when them real G's pull up on them. Or nothing like that obsessed woman who stays on the internet for seven hours a night drunk and claiming kids she doesn't have. The world we live in is beyond crazy right now. But in due time, we will get it together. This is Alicia with Dream Team News, and we still running shit. Now back car with the sports. Coronis. Yes. Wait a minute, hold up. You know I gotta do this for my city. For my city. PC in the building is you with me. Last but I'm certainly not least. Time to step to the mic, cause y'all done woke up. 
with the beat, yeah. Come on. I can kick out niggas with a basic flow. I ain't got to put no thought into none of y'all hoes. Your man said he like me and your man's too. Yeah, the hook me, I'ma put the bras to the side and y'all can keep being haters from the back of the line. That's what I said, I can keep being haters from the back of the line Cause I stay on my grind, this is the I gotta get mine You know about me stopping no matter how many times I'm on another level, you haters out of your mind And when you hit this you know you gotta go on the miseducation Now I don't, I used to love him Now I some, but you really lost one. You just lost one. It's so silly. How come? When it's all done, did you really gain from what you done done? It's so silly. How come? Adam Broad Day, pull up, pop it, and buck the chrome. At the trial, I'ma tell my lawyer to be R. Kelly and say, I don't see nothing wrong. Nigga better talk to me like he want to live before the burner clap. Because once it's up, it get hot for you. Bitch, you big one with a thermostat. And you can run if you want because the stick got range, so I ain't really worried about it. And I don't got good aim, so if you stand in the crowd, I'ma point it at everybody. Hey, look, fully automatic with the titties on it, nigga. I came and seek a settlement. The chopper go they got a speech impediment. Dog, I'm a lethal nigga. I'm dripping ether. I defeat and deceased a nigga. I'm gonna let the butt of this AR sit on your face. You're gonna think it's my Keisha, nigga. It's about to get drastic for you. I'm gonna grab a stress, click clack, and blast a nine. As soon as I stretch his ass, I'm gonna call the police tell him Mr. Fantastic died. Some shit you ain't hardly seen. I'm a stalk a beam. Let it punch in your heart and spleen. Now we got bad blood, like mosquitoes realizing that they didn't get Charlie Sheen. I got a new 380. I'm gonna pop this bitch and disperse to my hands tender. Took out the original clip, put a dick at the bottom, and now it's a transgender. I get a drop on this nigga. I pull up and pop on the nigga. I let out the stock on the stick. I'm rocking it. I like to flow with your ass if I pull out the mop on this nigga. Rock is a finishing move. This holds the job. Off his ass out in broad day. Pull up, pop it in. Yeah. Uh, they don't fuck with your movement until it's moving. I done seen niggas with size like bitchy shoes. Uh -huh. Hard of a winner, hate to say that you lose. I'm fighting a good fight, body marked with bruise. Uh -huh. Seen dark clouds because of them hard times. Little niggas growing up in the soldiers carrying knives. Uh -huh. They done said they gonna kill me. I ain't hard to find, I'm taking all of y'all with me. Man, I'm going for mine. Uh -huh. Pussy niggas talking crazy when they up on Instagram. Ain't no Muslim over here, my nigga. I'm going ham. <laughs> I grew up in the Jets, y'all wouldn't understand. Yeah, shit was really rough for me and my whole fam. Right. And yeah, we fought each other like we with some total strangers Put it on the hood They say their life wasn't danger uh, Beating up niggas That wasn't from where we from We swung with our hands Most times Play with guns If you ain't have a burner Better just duck and run Or stay low up in the bushes And wait for the cops to stop uh, The way how I was raised OG's paved the wave I don't know what's going on With these clowns today You claiming you're a killer Toting the big machine Old time use a bitch You might as well wear Maybelline uh, There's cases uh, in his punks Fitting right in between On some faggot boy shit From Genesis See what I mean Look if I destroy your person, it'll be you mumble rap guys For whack lines and keep saying you bag down mm. Famous for talking, you met the plug a thousand times Nigga, stop lying, listen The only plug you ever met was a socket for the TV I explode on you niggas, call me TNT mm. Ball so hard like Steph Curry for the referee When I shoot three, they land in your face officially mm. uh, And yeah, my whole team bananas Call Beast John Henry the way I'm swinging them hammers You be banned from TV, smack your bitch with a camera And yup, you're not a goon, you just broke with an attitude. You rob who when I turn your brains in a dog food. All you mumble rappers retarded like the real kind. And that wasn't a metaphor or punchline. Come at me, say my name like one time. And that will be the end of your life like when Christ died. Yeah. I don't know why these niggas start with me, but if it's beef, we in your crib like a house party. Mm -hmm. You stop a nigga down the hamburger beef. The only way your mother recognized you was your feet. Uh -huh. <laughs> What you gon' do now? Mm. Hope your body got something about to put it down. Tell yeah. you know that I will never disrespect you. Mm. We have tomorrow, but tonight I wanna spank you. Mm. 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 Mm.
one knows. Trying to say stuff with the say go. There you go again, that voice is cool. Watch you make your girlfriend go. Oh, come on, oh, come on, oh, come on. The wind when and where I be the cousin rockets in the industry Making this so far she can't sleep About to catch a whiff of some dishes y'all never heard before. Before, before. DJ Kenny K. 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 Yeah. Little mama got the 
Gucci bag, please. Uh, a DNG depression. Uh, she powering over pride. She go crazy over dress. Yeah. You can catch her in the mirror. Yeah. You can catch her in the mouth. She be working all week. Saturday, she taking off. Work, Dude, work, work, yeah, work, yeah, right. That nine to five don't pay enough, though. What you need, I clear your bills plus some other tip, yeah.
go, let's go. Cause it's hot in this motherfucker already. Shit, goddamn good God Almighty. So, 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 we back on the Dana J Show. What's going on, y'all? Y'all know what it is. Y'all heard the lies. Y'all heard the rumors. Y'all heard the innuendos from this bitch that sleeps on the bed and look like a fucking wrinkled ass dog. You just can't. You Look, this bitch look just like that motherfucking cat, don't you? I'm just saying. I tried to leave people alone. I ain't even going to go through salutations. If you want to donate, you know how to donate. But I will say this. Dana J is collecting money for his legal fees, right? And I'm going to break all that shit down. Because only a stupid motherfucker, and excuse my French, and they're not going to monetize this. Because they're going to be like, oh, no, he done cussed already. DeWan, what's up, baby? Charlotte back in business. What up, Charlotte? Love ya. Only a stupid motherfucker will go on their community wall and their live and lie. Then you got another dumb motherfucker down in Houston, Texas that ain't do shit but scam. And now and all of a sudden, you want to try to put that bone on me. Everything I said I was going to do, I've done. Every time I collected something, it was for a reason. And I showed receipts on everything. So now I'm going to walk this shit back. And I'm going to tell some secrets. Because what you ain't going to do is play with me. See, you got me fucked up. And the minute you say I'm lying, I'm a post note. I'm going to go live. Because posting the shit on community walls now, y'all like striking motherfuckers. Community wall talking about he harassing and bullying me. So I haven't said nothing for the latter part of yesterday. I came out of court yesterday. I said, nobody won. They up here giving parties. Hey, look at the party. Get a party. Once again, for the stupid motherfuckers. And I'm going to break this shit down yet again for the final time. If you don't catch it, that's your motherfucking fault. So I'm going to do it like this. The Newton County suit. Dumbasses. Was a civil suit. Dumbasses. You're a liar over there. You ain't know that Angie Laverne Walker or Angie Laverne Dore Walker, whatever the fuck your name is. Somebody tag Audrey in the chat. Because, see, I'm going to do a marathon on you, bitch, and you're going to stop playing with me. What up, Chi Town? Somebody, hey, Mama Mary. What up, Miss Belinda? Big baby Pernell was good. Miss Virgo, Miss Lady, I see you. Big pop in the building. What up, what up, nephew? My broker's turn. Yo, I got to do this real quick. Today is a special day. Shout out to my bro, Bree. He's celebrating his birthday. He just turned 23. You know what I mean? It is what it is. Enjoy your birthday, my nigga. But I'm going to step out with you later on. I got to say this. For you to be a lawyer, you talking about, oh, I got to Google this. I got to Google this. I, I, I'm I stuck about some shit. And this bitch got her nose in everybody's business, right? This bitch like 70 years old sending coochie pics out to motherfucking 
I ain't gonna say that because I ain't beefing and with dude no more. So I ain't gonna say that about him. But you sending people coochie pics who's not interested in your sex. Now, I said I wasn't gonna play with a motherfucker, right? So when the COVID people left her channel, right? She came back into the dream team. And she knew behind the scenes that I wasn't fucking with her. Now, I'm going to say this. I'm about to cancel some friendships. But guess what? I don't fuck with her. And she played with me too long. And then she played with me in your face. So now I'm going to play with you back, bitch. I'm the one that put you out of our group. I'm the one that put you out of our group, motherfucker. I'm the one that said, I ain't fuck with you three months before I stopped coming on your page. And the only reason why I came on your page was to show face. You know what I'm saying? The only reason why I came on there was to show face. So let's ask some questions. Are you ready? Let's answer some questions. Are you ready? Because I think I've been carrying bones long enough. So when I see you shouting out a bitch that I don't even fuck with, and I'm going to keep it real. Everybody know, and I'm going to say names. Everybody know I don't fuck with the unfit drunk. Everybody know that. But it's because motherfuckers that was over here and over there, and over there, and over there, and over everywhere was scared of the unfit drunk. So let's break down some shit. Angie, are you ready to tell some secrets? Are you really ready to tell some secrets? Are you really ready to tell an unfit drunk the real secrets? Oh, no, no, I ain't calling you no bitch, Audra. Audra, I need that whole file on that unfit drunk bitch. I meant not the unfit drunk. Uh, the Lioya bitch, the one that's down in Florida. Or the one that live in the lower room. And the one that her ex-boyfriend is renting the room out to her and she giving her SSI check just so she can stay in the motherfucking room. Now, bitch, go call your friends on this one. Because you never had a designer shit that was real. And see, and when you play with Boom Boom, I know Boom Boom can break your ass down, so I ain't get into that. But are you really, really, are you really, 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 Angie? Since you want to big up Randa, I'm going to put it out there. Are you really ready to tell the truth? How you beg the Dream Team women and myself to give you everything on Randa so that way you can get her son taken away from him? Now tell me I'm lying. Now tell me I'm lying. That's where the inquiry come from. But what was the inquiry? Wasn't it a call? Oh yeah, motherfucker. Wasn't it a call? That went into Randa uh, uh, office and the call happened about 11, 13 a.m.? Just one, just one day, to be exact, one Tuesday at 11, 13 a.m. Because you were so tired of that bitch, right? Your, your words, not mine. You were so tired of that bitch. But I get it. If you can't beat them, you join them. So when she dissected your daughter and you, you came after me. But you came after me after you wanted to seek refuge with me. You went quiet because you were scared and you was afraid that Randa and Pat would team up and bust your ass. So you came and got the one man that haven't been defeated. And because I didn't give a fuck about Randa, I said I'd do it. So I took your heat, bitch. Now, you stand in your shit. Bitch, there's no secrets going on. 
when Ms. Connor put out there that you were secretly trying to give Dream Team business information, me and Brooke Ben said then, we don't fuck with you. But no, I tried to give you the benefit of the doubt. And when you tried to come at me on your live, the live that you won't put up, bitch, when I said, why are we beefing about the Bolski? Man, you don't have that issue. You claim you ain't fuck with him, right? At that point, I already knew you fuck with him. One thing about me is I know how to easily let a stupid motherfucker down. And I did that on your live. And when I left, I ain't never been back, have I? And when I left, the dream team left. That was all a plan. But wait a minute. That's when you went on that rant and rave. Oh, oh, you grown. You shouldn't go and listen to somebody else. Uh, uh, he controlling y'all. He this and this. Of course you're going to get on your live and talk shit. Because the same motherfuckers from the COVID people back over there, you talked about. Let's talk about how you wanted to call CPS on a... Uh, on uh, uh 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 what the fuck that girl name is shit oh man what the fuck her name is oh the one that showed you her ass the fuck her name is the one that live in South Carolina fuck that girl name is come on come on oh man and the one that be doing shits and giggles somebody throw her name in the chat see, see when you don't talk with somebody or talk to somebody and you forget the fuck that girl name is. Oh, man. Let's talk about how when she showed her ass and you was like, well, Dana, I'm going to call CPS and I'm going to have her kids taken from her. But what did Dana do? I kept my mouth shut. But you tried to play with me with them same people. Oh, you done fucked up. Because now I ain't holding shit. When you tried to disrupt my motherfucking life. Yo, come on. Hold on, yo. Nobody know the girl name? What the fuck? Hold on. Nobody know the girl name? Oh, man. Hold on. Nobody know the girl name. Okay. LaKendra. Thank you, Nikki M. God damn. It took Nikki M to come from her job with her kids and everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Let's talk about how you was jealous because you thought one pat was fucking with JoJo. Now, see, I'm going to keep it. See, see. I was keeping shit quiet because, see, all right, cool, bro, but I got you, Big Papa, because, see, here's the thing. You confided in me with a lot of shit, and if you notice, every time you called me, I just shut up, and when you called me, I was at work, so you can't say I recorded you. I got you, Big Papa, and you can't say I recorded you. Because I didn't. Because I didn't think that we had to spin this block again. Last time, man, you got into it, bitch, you had an asthma attack. And what, what did I say? If she die, let her die. But everything that one pap and boom, boom, and was saying was accurate. And the only reason why... You were saying that's not true. It's because you didn't want all of your business out there. But fat boy ain't the only one you sent your pussy pic to. Just know when you cross people, people talk. And somehow or another, it comes back to me. Just like you talking about, I just got on YouTube. No, bitch, you got kicked out of the beef sector. 
Because you sent your pussy pic to somebody who's no longer allowed on YouTube. So let's talk about this. You claim you hate me. You don't like me. But you confided in me and the dream team. If you hate me, if you don't like me, why was you over here fucking with us? Because you needed refuge, bitch. I didn't know. I didn't know. You know what? Everybody in the chat, say hi, Randa. Everybody put hi, Randa in the chat. Say hi, Randa. Because we know you watching. Oh, yeah. And the truth coming out today. So when you seen LaKendra on Randa channel and you called us crying, I can't believe this. I can't believe this. Them motherfuckers playing with my daughter and this and this and this. They not only did they play with your daughter. They played with your profession. Thank you, Audra. They played with your profession. Because let's be honest. When Randa first put out the, and when Randa first put out the, that you wasn't a lot, but that you wasn't a lawyer, me and Brooke looked at it. And how you think Lyoya came about? Shout out to my sis Brooke, lover for life. And then you got mad because. I wouldn't let you over talk Brooke. What I look like letting somebody I'm cool with that talks about me behind my back constantly over talk somebody that I fuck with and I got a history with and I still fuck with from day one. Make this shit make sense. <laughs> now, let's get to the bottom of it. When you dox one pap and said her house was only 68000 and she got a mental condition and this and this. And listen, how did I know that? You sent me her file. Ha, this Angie. Do this for one pap. Just like you did for, just like you did for motherfucking Randa. Ha, Randa ain't no lawyer. I mean, Randa ain't who she say she is. She claims she a teacher or a principal. That's what it was. And she claims she a principal. So when you sent it to me and I looked at it, I said, ooh, she lied. And I went live with it. And you jumped in the chat laughing. And then you went silent. But you're mad at me because your friend is caught in a situation. And then you're going to lie. First of all, understand the rules of engagement. <laughs> Court yesterday, nobody won. The judge said he couldn't see in a system where your friend was served. And then he said, I cannot rule on this case. That's court procedures. Now, what actually happened was the paperwork got caught up from Fulton County to Clayton, and nobody sent it over to Newton. If they would have sent the paperwork, dumbass, it would have been a different outcome yesterday. But the case in Clayton is not civil. It's criminal. So when you say, oh, why Dana J need a lawyer? Why not? Do you know what I'm asking for? If you knew what I was asking for, then you wouldn't be out here being dumb. So no, I don't have a public defender. That's your boy that you always love. Speaking on that, you said, I falsely accused Debo of what? when I read his charges, and then when Levi shitted on you last night, you ain't say shit. You sat in the chat. Matter of fact, I'm going to tell you what you said. I'm going to tell you what you said. 
Because, see, one thing I'm not is a fake-ass motherfucker. Your exact words was, hold on. Your exact words was, hold on, let me get this out. What that have to do with me? I can't arrest his ass. Call the cops. Don't call me. Ain't that you? Bitch. When Levi sat there and said, you allowed him to say what he was going to do to R. Kelly on your platform. You ain't had shit to say, but I get it. You was only over here to try to steal dream team members to come over to your delusional ass channel. But guess what? I'm solid over here. And people are and people are only going to fuck with the solid people. So. So why are you playing games? Let's go here. Are you going to tell the Kendra why you was trying to do an inquiry on her two kids on the time that her kids dad passed away? Or is that shits and giggles? And when I told you I fuck with LaKendra and I'm not doing that and you got mad? Because you asked me where she work and where do she live at? And I told you I'm not giving you shit. I fuck with LaKendra. That was during that time. Man, LaKendra don't speak no more. And I'm still not giving out her shit. So Angie, so why are you trying to go around here and play the game? Understand this. And this go for you too, Bear Bug. I'm not represented by the state. So me going to get a lawyer is my best interest, especially what I'm asking for. Now watch this. Only a fool wouldn't go get a lawyer, but let me break the ice. The problem ain't that I went and got a lawyer. The problem ain't even the amount. The problem is y'all bitches are mad because I asked the dream team to help me with my lawyer. Not a lawyer, but with my lawyer. But as long as y'all and y'all friends are scamming, everything is fine. But y'all try to run interference when it come to me because y'all don't want me to even out the playing field. Because with me evening out the playing field, y'all don't have nothing to laugh about. Y'all smiles turn into frowns. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to say this. I've never been fake and phony. And I've never been fake kicking it. But when I see an old 70-year-old bitch trying to climb back into the good graces of a 41-year-old female who don't fucking like you, it's a mental institution somewhere running around loose. When I see a fucking midget running around trying to climb back into this shit, not knowing what the fuck he talking about, and literally dick-sucking a nigga that bitched him on his own mama porch, there's a mental instability running around. When I see all these fucking fake ass motherfuckers, oh, we cool. That's my sis. But just yesterday, oh, I blow your motherfucking head off. Let's dock this bitch. Let's do this. Let's do this. Listen, I'm the only one that you don't see fake kicking it. You won't see me on Bed Bug page talking about, oh, yeah, Bed Bug. Oh, yeah, uh, 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 this, 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 this. What? Judah, what are you talking about? Oh, okay, okay, I see it, I see it. That's what I'm looking like. What the hell is he talking about? <laughs> and then he had the nerve to say, oh, yeah, he's scamming. You the biggest scammer on this motherfucker. You got two apartments, two cars, a trip, a dog that you rape, a bunch of motherfucking chicken, 
and clout chasing off of Dana J. And your only claim to fame is I illegally recorded Angelo Clary. But Angelo Clary ain't say shit. But what he been saying? But what you ain't going to tell nobody is how you literally virtually dick sucked Larry McGee to give you back a channel. Who does that? Who does that? When y'all struck my channel, I took it in stride. I let the people know, and I moved on. When I got it back, I didn't even know I had it back. The Bowling Brook stalker told me I got it back, and I was on his channel at that time. Go back and look at it. At no point have Dana J said, oh, we all need to be friends. Fuck I look like. I don't need y'all. Y'all need me. Watch this. I can do 40 lives and don't say their name. And my numbers will look the same. Tell them bitches to do 40 live without saying my name. Watch what they had. 12, 26, 48, 75. And my mic at voice, a do 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 do. I am the clout. So I understand why this bitch back here want to keep saying my name. Because you want somebody to pump up that shit. But wait, 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 wait. And before we go there, tell the people why you got the blue house, the red house, and the white house. Let's talk about how you was hoping Larry was going to leave Janine to come fuck with you, bitch. Uh-oh. Now, if you think I'm lying, let's go back when Larry was going to jail. Why did you get mad because Sidbo was in the room with him? I told you, all your secrets is fine. I take this shit to the grave. But when you try to play with me with the same people that you play with, nah, bitch, I destroy you. I will destroy you. I am not that type of guy. So I get it, Angie, Angelina, Laverne, Dorian, whatever the fuck your name is. You came out on your community wall saying something about me. I responded, you struck my community wall. I get the picture. You only got to show me your hand once. Your whole goal is to try to take my pages. I get it. I'll never play into your game. But let's keep a shit a buck. Bitch, you on the internet trying to fuck anybody that, anybody that you can. And the only reason why, man, I swear to God, I don't fuck with Fat Boy. But the only reason why, the only reason why he was buying you subs is because he felt sorry for you. That was our last conversation. And I said, why do you feel sorry for this bitch? And he, he was like, no, nah, Dana, come on, man. Stop, Dana. Don't go back and forth with her. I'm not. Tell that bitch to go live and walk to the kitchen. I bet you she won't. So you can talk about me having a California king. I love it. I sleep well on night, at night. But bitch, you sleep in a full size bed. I'm quite sure fat boy probably was. That's what he do. That's what he do past Define. But, but see, but they, they don't have the nerve to send me their lives. So when I hear all of y'all that's trying to band together, and I get it, y'all trying to put the whole crew back together, I get it. I stand alone. I've been saying that. The Dream Team is a peculiar group of people that we don't give a fuck about none of y'all. 
Let's get this straight. Anytime I step out, I shits on everybody. So, Angie, I don't need you to be like, oh, Dana J looked good. No, nah, no, nah, I, I don't need that. What I need you to do is show them bags that you claim that you got because Gucci got three tags on it. Three. Well, I keep telling you, us Baltimore folks do the real shit, not the knockoffs. Gucci got three tags. Prada got four. Polo got two. Fendi got three. It depends on the line. So all the bags, and you claim you got, can you show a bag, but I got the matching tags and the serial numbers, bitch? Stay in your lane. That part right there. When she blamed me for scamming her shit, and she knew I didn't scam her motherfucking shit. But she knew, and my dumb ass fell for it, but she knew that if she come out and attack me, that I'm attack her ass back. And what happened? Everybody went to her page. But guess what? Three months later, you came back crying to me. Oh, I can't believe that Kendra and them is on random page. I hate that bitch. Da, 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 da. And then the shit that got me is we wouldn't have never knew about random brother page if you ain't say shit. You was the main one. She ain't got no daughter. She ain't got no daughter. That's her brother daughter. But then you want to reverse ship. When you felt as though, oh, I can't beat these motherfuckers. They looking up my profession. They got my motherfucking shit and this and this and this and this. And then I'm going to go here. Y'all call Audra the feds, right? But y'all say Randa doing the right thing. So guess what, Audra? Con continue being a feds. Put up your middle finger and say, fuck them. And when you come on your period, bleed real hard in a pad and throw it at it and throw it in their face. Fuck these whores. That's where we at with it. And I'm going to say this. As of today, I'm going to make Audra part of the motherfucking dream team. Fuck y'all. Now, let's address some lies. Oh, Dana ran from the P.I. Really? Really? When I came into court and he said what he said, I replied back to him. Nice and loud. I ain't mumble under my voice. And he got quiet. When, when, I, they, when I, they was walking out, he said, Oh, you look good in your clothes. The fuck? When the judge said he couldn't hear the case because it wasn't no proof in the system that the other person and was served, what did he say? Mr. Jackson, you can leave first. They had a three-part escort for me. Why do you think I went live, dummies? Just in case if they decided to pull me over for somebody lying, I will be live about it. I'm not dumb. I'm the wrong color to be playing in Newton County. Because if you get convicted in Newton County, you're going to Jackson. And Jackson is the chain game. And I ain't going on nobody chain game. I take my chances in car before I fuck around in Newton. And I don't even go to Jackson. So understand what y'all are talking about. From sheriff to sheriff to police department. And then I went to the QT and stayed there. And by the time they went live, I was already in Clayton. So you think I'm going to turn back around, drive another 40 minutes back out there just for them to be gone? Only a stupid people. Only a, man, JoJo's playing with that lady mind, man. 
She, listen, Angie put out there that JoJo paid her $250 to fuck. I don't even think JoJo even seen that bitch before. I'm going to keep it a buck. I don't even think JoJo seen that bitch before. That's why I couldn't understand this whole shit about, and when JoJo and Carla was dealing with each other and then Angie tried to get close to Carla, I said, wait a minute. Angie was talking shit about Carla. But I get it. Carla her own lady. But Baltimore going to stand for Baltimore. I'm going to tell you that. Just like Chicago stand for Chicago. And don't nobody say shit about that. Whether they right or wrong. Baltimore going to stand for Baltimore. Fuck. Uh, excuse me. Sheila, thank you for becoming a member to the Dream Team. Well, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Sheila just came and been a part of the Dream Team and what we do. So, Angie, I'm just trying to figure out. Because I know you're going to go live talking about He lied. I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for it. Because you have done so much shit. And I've overlooked a lot of shit about you. But bitch, you ain't nothing but a bottom barrel feeding bitch. You worse than a carp. And you come on here with a swollen face. Trying to get sympathy. And you hope people going to donate to you and don't nobody donate to you. And you think people coming on your channel and to laugh with you and they laughing at you. <laughs> Bitch, we know you as a Google queen. You have no case to talk about. I teach kid, bitch, you was a greeter at Walmart. And I'm not knocking you because every job is a job. But I, but I find it quite funny that all of a sudden you want to talk about this case. I'm going to tell you how clever Dana is. You were the only one that knew I worked at Southern Regional at the time. And every time you would call me, I'd be at work. And I purposely told you I was at Southern Regional. So I find it funny that you think that people are securing wins. That's why I'm quiet. Because you want me to come out and say, oh no, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this. I got this lawyer, I got this lawyer. No, lightning won't strike twice with me. The problem is y'all don't want that playing field even. And when Dana, Ask the dream team to help them. That's Dana in the dream team business. But when other people scam, when your friends scam, and when, when your friends say that they need, that's all fine and dandy. But when Dana say he need, it's a problem. Why? Are you hoping that one day the Dream Team ladies and the Dream Team fellas and will come and donate to you? You only got a room that you rent. Skip a payment. I bet your boyfriend tell you what he told you a while back when you got off of line for a minute. Oh, you got to go. Randa wasn't lying when she said your daughter don't fuck with you. Because you called me at work a couple times asking me, what can you do to repair the shit between you and your daughter? And I said, I, I don't know. And I just start telling you shit out of my ass. Like, just give us some flowers. Take out the E. Shit. 
Y'all supposed to be cool. So you going on your community wall talking about I'm being represented by the state. With what I'm asking for, I need a lawyer, not a lie lawyer. So I get it. Y'all all want to throw a wrench in what I got going on. Y'all more invested in my life than I am. And I live this shit. And it's the best life ever. Y'all weird. And y'all dumb. And some of y'all stink in real life. So the second time me and Pat got into it, we ain't had to get into it. But I took up for you, Angie, because you were scared that Pat and Randa was going to come and bust your ass down. <laughs> and what did I tell you? Just send me what you got. I'm cool. Mm -hmm. I'll look over it and I'll put it together. But I'm starting to see some shit that I overlooked. And this is what I be saying to people. When you see the red flags, we don't act on them. We, we overlook them. And the red flags are you will start shit and then go behind that person back and make up with that person and just keep it off the scene mm -hmm. and then make it seem like the person that's taken up for you is the problem. And that cancer has spread it throughout YouTube. I get it. But have you ever thought about this? A civil lawyer, I mean, a civil case don't need a lawyer. A criminal case does. Watch this. Fannie Willis was being questioned. Why do she need a lawyer? And she a DA. Donald Trump, the whole team and go defendants was grilling Fannie Willis. Why do Nathan Wade need a lawyer? So when y'all talk about the case is thrown out, no, the fuck it ain't. That was the baby. And the only reason why that skated is because the paperwork ain't get turned over to the proper jurisdiction on time. Found that out today. But you want to know the good thing about that? I can go out there Monday and refile again. I can go Monday and refile for a TPO again. And with the footage I got, somebody lied. So for a regular TPO, that's a misdemeanor. But for a criminal TPO and for a bond, don't you think it was something found? Hmm. So while y'all trying to attack me on behalf of y'all friend, understand this. I ain't beefing back with y'all. I, I I ain't beefing back with y'all. Y'all can attack me all you want. But I'll give you this nugget. Don't let don't let your attacks get you put in a fucked up situation. That's all I'm gonna say. So Angie, why you hating on my seasoning? No, I don't dig up my nose and do the seasoning, none of that. No, 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 no. But I got to ask the question, bitch. Do you wash your ass every day? Or do you wear the pen triple XL? Because you can't wear underwear. And remember that conversation? You're allergic to certain fibers and certain brands, right? 
and you can't get out because your body's swollen. So understand, stop playing with me and just depend on your depends. Don't make me have to go live and do this again. And I know Bed Bug gonna go live. Let him talk. I will never go back and forth with a bum ass nigga. Shout out to EJ. Welcome to the Dream Team, baby. EJ just became a member. I will never go back and forth with a bum ass nigga. And I get it. He need the cash apps again, so he's slowly but surely trying to get into this shit. I get it. Y'all scamming motherfuckers learn from the best. And I ain't taking nothing from Bed Bug. He'd tell him, that's the only motherfucker I know that'll tell a motherfucker to go suck his dick and then hit his cash app and they do it. That's a skill. But that's a skill that only underprivileged bitches deal with. So, Angie, when Levi was talking about your boy that you probably virtually had phone sex with, that's locked up, why didn't you get offensive to Levi? Because we all seen you come in a chat and Levi was on my channel and you was trying to up in him. And then when he spoke on it, you got mad and went to your channel and went live. But you was on Levi's channel last night and you can ask Levi, I told Levi, I don't fuck with you. And Levi, oh nephew, man, just give her a chance. I said, I don't fuck with her and I don't fuck with nobody that fuck with her. I stand on principle. You will never see me backbiting on nothing. Them motherfuckers came to court yesterday. They were my fans. They were happy to see me. When I wasn't even thinking about them. I was happy to see Mr. Hill in person. Thank you, Sheila. Appreciate you for the four piece. I was happy to see Mr. Hill. And I was hoping that we could have sparred against each other. And I'm going to tell you why. Because he took the bar exam. I didn't. And I get to sharpen my skills in a civil case. But in a criminal case, I get to watch two motherfuckers go at it. And the only problem is one lawyer had facts. The other lawyer had hearsay and feelings. So when you hear people talk about the file, what's in that file? Mm -hmm. And I gave fair, fair warning out the motherfuckers. Fall back. Because I can easily add you to that file. And these are things that you've done. So when I see motherfuckers sit up there talking about, oh, that's my sis. And I sit back and I be like, this bitch just sat back and, talk, and told me that and talked to me about and this and that. Hmm. You sat up there and said, motherfuckers talking about my daughter and talking about me and did nothing. But then you want to attack me for your friend. Do you know how easy that is right now? Do you know just how easy that is right now for me to just laugh at you?
That's all. Do you know how easy it is for me to laugh at you? And I'm going to keep it a buck. I want to thank everybody that donated so far. And we on the road to 5,500. And 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 I've seen Lord slide. Oh, yeah, he took up 2,000 for a federal lawyer and this and this and this and this. Well, lawyers have retainer fees, right? And I'm going to say this. If nobody is talking about people raising $10,000 in one day, why is people so concerned about what I'm doing to help me in my situation? If y'all ain't going to talk about people raising $10,000 in one day, don't worry about what I'm doing. That's just facts. And I'm about to tell you a total as of right now. Hold on. I'm about to tell you a total. Right now, we got 500. Now we got to get the big part, which is that five grand. And I believe that we can do it once again. And once I get that five grand to add with that 500, guess what? Only certain people that heard me talking to the lawyer know what I'm going to do. He told me, once you get that 5,500, send me the, in I mean, call me, I'll send you the invoice and you pay for it and I'll send you the receipt. And what I'm going to do as soon as I get the receipt, everybody that donated, I'm going to do a private, a private Zoom call and I'm going to send it to everybody that donated. And I know who donated and who didn't. I'm going to send it to everybody that donated and everybody going to come in and I'm going to show the receipt and I'm going to have the lawyer to talk to us exactly. So if y'all have any questions, y'all can talk to the lawyer. But damn, y'all thought Gerald Griggs was going to represent me, didn't y'all? And I'm going to say this. When people say they're going to do something and don't do it, they lying. So Gerald Griggs have not been on nobody platform to confirm anything. So is it safe to say that that person lied? Once again, what have Dana lied about? You can't even say it. Gerald Griggs, once again, I can say it. Gerald Griggs have not been on nobody platform to confirm or deny that Dana J was begging him to represent me in a case for free and to turn around and, and deliver the savage's daughter to them. What the fuck? What type of twisted shit is that? Understand this. That's how you get shit or get people to have shit falling apart. Ah, Shonda said, hold on. 5,000 more so you can finally pay for that car. You owe that old lady. And again, I don't have a dog in his fight, but it's giving sassy band IMO shaking my head. Now, Shonda... Now, can I ask you a question? If I can prove to you that I don't owe nobody no money for no car, are you willing to come back in here and give me an apology? That's all I want to know. Because, see, now I'm going to make y'all motherfuckers stand on business. If y'all can jump out there and talk shit and sound stupid, I'm going to jump out there and make you stand on business. I'm going to make you stand on business. Ooh. Oh. 
is over overloaded or under maintenance. Hold on. Here we go. Yep, it's overloaded. So just to let you know, my case in Fulton County has been transferred to another judge. But once again, y'all was misled and said, oh, I lost that case too. Y'all was misled. It was transferred to another judge. And the judge name is Leftridge, Leftridge, Judge Leftridge. So when y'all getting information, can y'all make sure that y'all know the truth? Thank you, Georgia girl. Georgia girl in the business. She's in the building. Oh, Georgia girl, I got to talk to you. Somebody, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry about this. Sheila, please forgive me. I, but I had a long week. I had a long week. Georgia girl, I got to connect you with someone that wants you to do something, wants you to make something for them. Now, they've been jealous from day one. The minute I said I'm not taking nobody else to see Rob, that's when everybody true colors came out. And let's keep it real. I keep saying it. If you go back to day one, you'll understand that the only beef that Dana had at the time was with the lady I'm in court with and Bedbug. Randa included herself into the shit. Marshall included himself into the shit. Dom K got mad because I took his wrench. He's really mad at Sidbo. Not at me, but he want to take it out on me because I took his wrench. I don't give a fuck. Um, not yet. I ain't get my apron yet. Um, Call me when I get off here, Georgia girl. Because I seen something delivered, but it was to, to the wrong place. And I ain't want to touch nobody's stuff. So I'll go over there and find out. I'll find out. So when people talk shit, understand and know what they're talking about. They don't know what they're talking about. Angie talking about, oh, this case is over with. That case is over with. How is it over with? If it was over with, I would say it's over with. I don't have a problem giving an update on what's going on. Because I know a lot of misinformation going to be out there. I don't want to misinform nobody. Just like I found some messages from Oh So Lovely. I think I need to post them. Because some of my narrative is going to be off. Somebody narrative is going to be off. And when I seen it, I said, well, I'll be damned. I didn't even know this was in my phone. Thank you to the power of the screenshot. I'm going to say this. A person got jealous of me and Randa's relationship. I'm not going, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. I'm not going, in, in the beginning, it was that. It was something special. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. But as the venom got involved, it became toxic. And it went from a relationship to a hate shit. And now we both hate each other. But the difference is, I can do without. I don't have to say nothing about them. They can't live without saying nothing about me. 
I'm the reason why they exist on the internet. So when people try to lure games like, oh, yo, I bet you a thousand dollars and you can't say nothing about them, nigga, I'm going to take your money and I'm going to shut up. And then after I take your money, when they try to play with me, I'm going to respond. I'm from a city that don't play no games. And I'm from a city, if you got on something fake, Angie Walker, we will call your ass out. We, oh, we used to send people to the flea market just to see who we going to see at the flea market. Take pictures of the nigga. And when they come to the club stunting, we'll get on the mic. Hey, yo, that nigga got the fake travel foxes on. Shout out, rest in peace to Tony Boston, a.k.a. Miss Tony. One thing I learned. That when people want to be you, they study you, they emulate you, they try to be you, and they try to do anything for you or about you. They want your mere existence. Thank you, Shorty. But the problem is, ooh, I bag said, at Nell Taylor, 50, jealous of a 50-year-old broke overweight who can't keep a job or an apartment. The one that has to beg for cash apps because he's poor as fuck. Laughing emoji. Or because he stink. Laugh my ass off. Why be jealous? Who's 50 and who's overweight? He don't even have a savings at 50. Why would anyone be jealous? Ew, he wears the same three shirts. Yeah, real jealous. Oh. I don't know who you're talking about. But eye bags, let me help you with something. The only person that's 50 is Bed Bug. The only person that wears the same three shirts is Bed Bug. So can you please don't come on my channel talking about another content creator? If you're going to come on my channel, make sure it's directed to me. Now, if you say I don't have a savings account, okay. I don't if you're trying to make fun, funny and say I'm 50, then okay. If you're trying to say I'm overweight, then I, I don't think I'm overweight. If you're trying to say I can't keep an apartment, I had several. And I even got apartments for other people. I never know nobody to stink over this way. Ain't nobody delete your comment, EJ. That probably was a, a, a YouTube doing it. Or you might have used the word that I uh, have blocked. So eye bags, can I ask you a question? When you look like this, right? How can you fix your lip to say anything? Now, I know I got a lazy eye, but your shit fixed and drunk and stupid at the same motherfucking time. I'm just trying to figure out who the fuck are you? I never known grown motherfucking people that got to hide behind avatars. But if this not an avatar, if this is really you, you're an ugly motherfucker. And I got to put it out there. You are ugly as shit. 
you look like you got a stroke and Down syndrome at the same motherfucking time. And there's some ugly characters on YouTube, but you take the cake. No. Hey, you know what? And Sheila, don't say that name because that's the name that that the uh, Bolingbrook dude and uh, uh, and a bed bug gave her. Uh uh. But don't say that name. Let's let them people have their own identities. But you know what? Eye bags. For me, and for you to hate me so much and don't know me, I bet I got more than what you and your grandmother and your grandfather have together and your mama. The problem is, y'all mad because I don't have to scam motherfuckers. I can just come and ask. And if they have it, they have it. If they don't, they don't. Y'all got to go and, hey, Jesus coming back tomorrow. Hey, look, I'm going to act like I'm Bon Jean and I'm going to go on these groups and I'm going to collect money and tell people that R. Kelly need $2,000 to get out of jail. That's all y'all. Hey, I'm going to go do a banner and I'm going to collect $17,000 Then I'm going to tell y'all. When the money hit my channel, that's my money. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying, man. Be careful of who you talk about. Because the same motherfuckers that get on here and hide behind God. Oh, God is so good. Oh, yeah. I got all this money. God is so good. Be the same God that'll say, you know what? I'm going to strip this dumb motherfucker because I don't know him. And you're right back where you started. I'm big, bro. I guess you got to get rent paid, huh? I guess you got to get them little cash apps. I guess you got to get them Walmart to Walmarts. Yo, leave me alone, man. Because if I do a memory lane, it's going to be bad. It's going to be bad. It's going to be bad. And I seen somebody talk about, oh, yeah, bed bug had Dana J's son mama up there. Oh, that's fine. I can't tell a grown motherfucker what to do. That part, Georgia girl. But I can't tell a mother, I can't tell a grown woman what to do. If she decided to talk to that brother, then hey, it's been years for me. But when I start doing fuck shit, I don't want nobody crying. I don't want nobody threatening nobody. Like I say, niggas will sit up there and attack Larry and for having their son on that platform. But you won't attack the motherfuckers that got the son for Larry. Better yet, you buddy-buddy with them motherfuckers. Chi-Town, yeah, I'm with you on that one. You can't fuck with them new niggas. Mm -mm. That's why you got to leave them motherfuckers alone. Oh, let me speak on this. One thing about me, y'all don't need to be making backdoor phone calls, neither talking about Dana J got you in paperwork. Listen. When I give people my word about stuff, I give them my word. But 
But what killed me is that brother was man enough to tell me what he did. That go a long way with me. When y'all motherfuckers still trying to do shit and still scared to admit what you did. But don't worry about it. All the players about to be revealed soon. And I'm going to have a field day. Like my president said, the only way to have a revolution and the truth be told is to have it play out in court. And that came from the great Donald J. Trump. All the players about to be revealed. And YouTube going to be shocked. All of this to take down one man that don't give a fuck about none of them. So I can no longer say I'm the king of YouTube. You can now call me the icon. Because without me, y'all couldn't get paid. So in other words, it's about to be 4,000 lives in about five, four, three, two, one. Nah. Because at the end of the day, I'm not responding. You only going to argue with yourself. You want to argue. No. You want to argue with me. No. Bedbug went and did 12, li 12 lives about me. Pitiful. And this the only response you get? You better go get another DJ gig, boy. You ain't going to get free rent off of me. You're going to have to build your shit organically, nigga. Get out the mud. And the boss can be home soon, I think. Go suck his dick. Because that's what you've been doing lately. Oh, the boss get there for a traffic ticket. This and this and this and this. Ain't this the same motherfucker that shot at you? And you said... Hey, C, go get a thing, C. Go get a thing. Go get a thing. The same motherfucker that ran you off of your mother's steps and smoked the blunt on your mother's steps. I can't get none of these motherfuckers in a close proximity without the police around. So what am I going to do? Am I going to crash and burn for clicks and views when I got the most to lose? No. Not me. Not me. Not me. That part, Judah, I'm going to say it and I'm going to scream it to the top of my lungs. Rest in peace, Larry White. That case need to be opened back up. I don't give a fuck what nobody say. That case need to be opened back up. He capitalized off of that baby's death and he tried to gain monetary gain, which means he did it premeditatedly. And that's not even a word, but I just created it. He did it premeditatedly. So I got a question. Why y'all motherfuckers talking about Dana J wrong, Dana J this, Dana J that? Y'all for kids and this and this? Why y'all same sorry, lousy motherfuckers ain't out there asking Cook County why can't justice be served on Larry White? 
Hmm. These are questions that I got asked. And I'm starting to feel like JoJo now. I'm starting to think that a lot of this shit is planned. Y'all do this shit for clicks, views, and for cash apps. A lot of this shit be planned. Because the shit that y'all said about each other, you can't come around me and, and don't have the police around. And I'm just going to sit there and laugh about that. Oh, yeah, did it, did it. No, son. I'm a wax on and I'm a wax off. I'm just saying, man. Understand this. Leave me the fuck alone. That go for all of you. Because I don't forget and I will spend that block. Just not when you think I should spin it. And I got pseudonyms for all you motherfuckers. Just like this wrinkled forehead bitch behind me. That lays in the bed and dream about Levi. Size 16 shoe. But you ain't going to tell Levi that, are you? Are you? You ain't going to tell everybody that that was your sister running down the goddamn street and them fucking scrubs and it wasn't you. Thank you, Miss Jennings. I appreciate you for the hundred piece. Oh, man. They really going to be mad now. Oh, my God. You know what you see what you got? Oh, my God. Hey. Listen, we taking this shit back to day one, y'all. If y'all want to donate, Donate what y'all want. Nothing's too big, nothing's too small. If y'all want to come on and talk on a hotline, we going to talk on a hotline. Fuck them people. We going to go back to doing us. We going to start blogging back on current events. We going to start doing what we doing. If y'all want me to talk about something, send me the story that y'all want me to talk about, and I'm there with y'all. We going to rock out. We going to do what we do. And I'm going to say this. If you ain't never do nothing that's too out there to try to hurt me or anything in my family, you can approach me about anything. But if you went over that board, you can't talk to me about shit. And I put that on God. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Ms. Jennings. I appreciate you. And I put that on God. If you play with me, and my offspring and it caused me to come back and play with you and yours you can't talk to me about shit mm -mm. can't talk to me about shit and you gotta go through the ladies of the dream team and whatever they say that's what it is so nine times out of ten i ain't even gonna hit because they gonna deal with it and it's different levels to them motherfuckers. And I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't mean to call them motherfuckers, but they motherfuckers. It's different levels to them. So depending on who you talk to, I don't know. Because the way they sound now, they, ain't, they don't want to talk to none of you motherfuckers. It's personal. Between us and all of y'all. And we want to keep Brooke in our prayers. Um, Brooke going through a trying time. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Um, I appreciate you. And I'm going to say this. And when motherfuckers try to come and talk to y'all about different people in private, don't talk to nobody. You call that person that they trying to talk to you about and you put them on the phone with them motherfuckers. But that's how you kill a lot of this drama. Because motherfuckers be trying to go back door and be like, oh, girl, and you shouldn't talk to him because this nigga, da, 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 da. this is what you need to say. Hold on. And call that person that, that they talking about. Let them know what's going on. And then bring them on. 
and see how that conversation go. Nine times out of ten, they're going to hang up. You know what I mean? Nine times out of ten, but they're going to hang up. So we in a season of killing false narratives, crazy objectives, and lies. If you are the weakest link, then let us know that you're the weakest link. So that way we, we can say, well, well, we can help you. But if you feel as though you want to go on your own, if you feel as though you want to go deal with another team, you don't got to fake like you got to sneak away. No. Just let motherfuckers know and be like, all right, peace. Come on. And then I'm going to say this. If you're talking to the dream team ladies behind my back and you think it's going to work, here's the way I'm going to do it. Ladies, if you get them calls and you feel as though that y'all need to dismiss them motherfuckers, dismiss their ass and call me and let me know and what happened. And I'll stamp it and say, fuck them. Thank you so much, Ms. Darlene. Thank you so much, Ms. Darlene, for the 20 piece. That's where we at with it. We ain't playing with motherfuckers no more. Call us a cult. Call us whatever. But one thing you won't call us, fake, phony, and drama fool. Since the Dream Team has been together and everybody else left, you haven't seen no drama and what else with us play out on social media. And people try to attack us. We the most solid group ever. Ever. Appreciate you so much, Ms. Darling. The most solid group ever. And then let's go here. And raising our money for the lawyer, right? I'm not going to do, or should I say this? If I ask y'all to do something, I'm going to participate. So I'm not going to ask you to do something that I'm not going to do. I'm participating as well. And I'm dropping my paychecks. Now, let me address this. When niggas find out you got a job, a good job, they do everything in their power to make you lose your job just to say that you don't have a job. Now, how miserable is that? Did they go over somebody here? Did they go over somebody here? And Ms. Virgo, did they go over somebody here? I'm going to say it again. When niggas find out you have a job, they will try to do anything in their power to make you lose your job just so they can say you don't have a job. Hey, Tanil. Y'all niggas is stupid, ignorant, dumb, cocky, retarded. Y'all stink. Y'all smell like a bunch of butt juice that sit out in Las Vegas in a dead heat. Y'all motherfuckers are dumb. Can I'm going to say it. Y'all dumb. Because if you think Y'all going to cost me another job? Lightning don't strike twice with me. And when the fire was hot and y'all had me did the rights, y'all should have got me then. But now, <laughs> this Dana J. Serm has been injected to the world. Can't fuck with me now. Because I'm not repeating the same shit. When y'all had me did the rights and I stood in front of the judges ready to accept whatever came to me and they said, we dismissing it. You ain't seen me come on here and talk about, oh, I won, I won. Nope, I just kept blogging. But I will say this, the real players are about to be exposed. 
And then I'm going to go a little deeper. If you really paying attention, the players are exposing their self as we speak. Just pay attention. Who all popping back out? Who all got something to say and what they talking about? I mean, I thought my brother Carrie broke it down the best. I thought my brother Carrie broke it down the best, but I guess not. I thought my sister Shy Town said it about. I mean, hold, hold on. Ain't this what they said? Just be sent me to jail. Yeah. yeah. The fucking nigga in the head. That's for them internet motherfuckers is out there meddling in other people's me business. Yeah, I ain't scared the fucking nigga in the head. Not all bloggers. You know who you are. Niggas and bitches said that we would never make it. What they talking about? Conquest and religion gave them bitches something to talk about. They tried to stop the book, but they can do it. Now that book is out. I'm gonna make them take back everything they said about their mind. These bitches out there lying on the player, they be chasing clouds. They never talk about the tea they spilling coming from their house. They all up in your business talking loud with that big old mouth. Nine times out of ten, don't know what they talking about. I know y'all believe in us, but it's only only yourself to die. If I was you, I'd be trying to get out, take another ride. If that can get you fucked up, I was out there trying to run your I mouth. see you have behind that keyboard, cause niggas wanna take you out. Yeah. We gon' hear you bitches something to talk about. We see you running off like diarrhea at yeah. the mouth. Them clicks and lights on your channel about to fade out. Stump them roaches, get that raid and kill them all now. Yeah. We gon' hear you bitches something to talk about. We see you running off like diarrhea at yeah. the mouth. Them clicks and lights on your channel about to fade out. Stump them roaches, get that raid and kill them all you now. You old broke ass bomb bitch, nigga, come and get you some. Fuck them bitches off of Kale's name Cause they slow and dumb Woman beating ass nigga Bet you won't fight a man Running up on bro Try to take a pick and shake his hand That's why he won't deal with you Never saw you as a man You and your whole entourage Full of fucking scam Making threats to my fam That's the wrong move boy Toxic people kin to me You think that shit is cool boy Spread lies saying we started this You broke the rules boy Drop that location Have you shaking in your boots Boy. Don't make me call them truths, boy. They posted on that roof, boy. Sending pictures to your enemies to show that proof, boy. Yeah, we gon' hear you bitches something to talk about. We see you running off like diarrhea at the mouth. Them clicks and lights on your channel about to fade out. Stump them roaches, get that raid and kill them all now. Yeah, we gon' hear you bitches something to talk about. We see you running off like diarrhea at the mouth. Them clicks and lights on your channel about about to fade out. Stump them roaches, get that braid and kill them all. I see y'all coming at my brothers and my family. That's a no no. Shot Town Finest, that's my sister, and she trained to go. Dana J, my brother, to the dream team about to blow. Haters in the. Oh, this a phone call. Hold on. This, this, is, a, this is a phone call. This ain't nothing but a phone call. Watch this. Yo, yo, bro, bro, but don't say too much. But uh, I got sent something, right? I got a, uh, I got a question, and, and I got you on live, so that way the people will know the truth. I, I got you on live. Uh, have you ever been reached out to by Diana Copeland? By who? By Diana Copeland. Never heard of him. Um. I'm going to read this. Hey, I spoke with Carrie Kelly today for a long time. He is willing to help with the investigation. We need you also. A lot has been revealed. We know for a fact from another source 
Rob has you on tape, also sexually. I'll spare you the details. Don't worry about Rob holding you accountable. One of the live and girls said, or one of the living girls said, you watched over them. So I guess this Diana Copeland sending a, a message to somebody, but I'm going to send you these uh, messages. I'm going to say this, man. I rebuke her and every every demon and demonic force that comes with that. Right. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. That's what I'm doing. I'm praying over things, man. That's right. I ain't never, I, I, I don't even know who that lady is. I got you, but I'm going to send it to you so that way you won't be blindsided, bro. Okay. Okay. But, uh, you know how we do. We just got to give these niggas something to talk about. Oh, you already know. <laughs> Matter of fact, you might as well bump that for them, man. I just got finished playing it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, bro. We'll talk when I get up. All right. Uh, all right, bro. All right. Like I said, that's nothing but a phone call. One thing I don't play with is you ain't going to lie on somebody that's cool with me, and I'm not going to correct it. That's what I'm saying to y'all. And when y'all start getting these backdoor conversations, you call a motherfucker that they talking about. And you have them tell that person what it is. Once you do that, all drama stops. So with that being said, I got to take it back for a second. That boy right there, he coming to a city near you real soon. Stunned on them haters like your boy superstar. If life was a movie, then you know my rated R. So fuck your whole crew, them two. Spotlight, um, ba, um, ba, do, ba, de, do. Stunned on them haters like your boy superstar. If life was a movie, then you know my rated R. So fuck your whole crew, them two. Spotlight, um, ba, um, ba. Talk your shit, boy. If they bury me alive, they'll just say I'm fresh to death. If that hoe don't act right, you gotta play it to the left. Feel like the real is walking as long as the Lord give me breath. I'm bad with the pen. Michael Jackson, Jermaine, don't hear me though. So, so deaf. Been on my grind, my own shadow shine. No more talk, reject the climb. Money tossing, that's all I'm hearing. So that other BS can get the hell off my line. About to go loot or roll out my biz. I'm on the clock, we'll ask you what time it is. How the fuck you bother when you came with who? I get the party. Jump and crash bandicoot. I don't fuck around with a nigga poop. Fuck with us, you be ready to make a suit. Different color diamonds in my motherfucking chain. Got it looking like a bowl of fruit loose. I'm old school shoot. Take your shit from a hoot to a coop. Late night and the neighbors like somebody's rocking, knocking the boots. Yeah. I'm just saying. One thing I do agree with Bear Bug on though is your YouTube is your resume. Your YouTube is your resume. And I'm going to say this. I don't know what that lady over there trying to do. I don't know what you're trying to imply. But I welcome all shit. So whatever you're trying to imply, sweetie, I'll never say your name. But I get sent to all your shit. Sweetie, listen. You came on YouTube frauding. You in the middle of YouTube fraud. You in the end of YouTube fraud. And you've been fraud. Don't make me put your little T out there. Only thing I'm going to say is this. You need to get that lady back on TV. And I'm going to leave it at that. On that note, this is a Friday night. I'm about to step out. Y'all do y'all thing. I'm going to do mine. We're going to have some fun. I'm up out of here. Y'all be blessed. And remember, YouTube is your resume. Remember you said that. Friendly reminder, I want you to stop worrying about who like your pictures, baby. They see you. They watching. 
You got your foot on their neck, baby. Big motion. And guess what? They gonna screenshot this and talk about you in the group chat. So you might as well go off. Ain't no tippy-toeing. Ain't no playing it small. Ain't no playing it safe, baby. You big pressure. Stand on that. <laughs> right now do not give a darn what opinion people have of you long as that opinion is not consistent of that of yourself you be you i'm not paying to make you feel good about me i already feel good about me i'm good message for the youngsters out there and the old old school not old fools look at me foolish shit and let's drive bandit yeah look all my diamonds wet, wet. I be fucking endless bitches through my Snapchat. They send me pictures of that pussy, I don't chat back. She had a baby trying to fuck me, oh, she snap back. She know a nigga always cap and he a snap back. And I just trashed the SRT and brought the hell cat. You know a gangster got fall, but you gotta bounce back. And man, you niggas way too old to keep on asking where your ounce at. Nigga hit me full brick, I'm rolling out the bed. They got 20 on your shit, we'll take this 40 to the head. Millennial clip, they got like 60, got like 30 in the sig. And only thing we got spares all the women and the kids. And let me tell you about my lady that's my baby and she story bad. Last nigga brought her up, fully brought her Louis bags. Heard it disrespect my name, know the boys blew his ass. I don't know why sitting on all this money like I'm Mr. Uh, Kraft. I can pick out any bitch I want, I got the gift again. Any bitch that ever fuck with me ain't had to live so bad. Yeah. It's a motherfucker guarantee that she gonna get a bag. Best to leave, I keeping our receipts when I'm gonna send a bag. Wow. Coronavirus gave my boys a take off. We was making 3,000 off of eight ball. And not to mention taking hits like we was eight off. Roll a ball of bacon soda like we had a bake off. And all my niggas hustle. And find a reason why these niggas never fuck with us. Cause all these half ass plugs, you sell them half ass drugs. And if you sell us that shit, you know we're stuck with us. Go get it. We gon' spin that bitch until we dizzy. We gon' find out everybody live and we gon' pop her like a willy. And we gon' keep them heats when niggas chilly. And all my Glock's black on, they ready to get busy. No kissy. Yeah, I peep the hate, but I got something for they dumb ass. All I need is one car with one Glock with one mask. Then I let off hella shot like I had a heat in both hands. All they gon' say a nigga in the or the gun man. Boy, it ain't no joke with us. Mark Clay only code for us. They say the club ran out of sections. Fully, it won't open up. Rollies residential when they bust, they probably go for us. Endless, 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 everything. They keep on quoting us. And I was on the yachty with them thotty, shout out Bruce Court. Only time we don't want the smoke is when it's new ports. And I be trying to find myself a rabbit trapping D-boy on his keys on my block. Shit, they be selling keyboards. I am only playing offense on point like a shark fan. Brought my own water to Miami, I'm a dolphin. They like fully think he found himself, I never lost it. I can go to Neiman Marcus now with my closet. Cause I be overflowing with that drip shit, I'm a faucet. I got endless bitches that snacks, my phone a mob. And I gotta keep my foot on their neck, this shit a carpet. I don't give a fuck about these rappers, that shit is garbage. DG was home. They said that's not my paper. Now my man locked down and I still got that paper. Matter of fact, I'm getting cheese like that nacho flavor. I should call my nigga killer. This a nacho banger. I don't really need no features. This is nacho banger. All you hear is boom, boom when that Glock go ringing. Straight to my cell, zoom, zoom when that iPhone ringing. These niggas walking down with us because they blocks ain't banging. <laughs> Said I wanna take a dip in your pool. Just go for a look out there. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes I'm misty, bro.